We continue exploring Kuala Lumpur, this vibrant city, the capital of Malaysia. We've already visited Dataran Merdeka Square and Kuala Lumpur City Gallery in our previous episode. And today we're planning to walk around Chinatown, visit Yalan Patalin Street Market and see what local vendors have to offer. We've decided to take a shortcut through the back alley in hopes to find Chinatown. You might want to avoid walking through the back alleys as it's not the most scenic route to say the least. We're pretty experienced travelers and have seen many things traveling through Southeast Asia. But I can see how some people might find it off-putting. Our advice is to stay on the main streets and don't stray of course. We're at Yalan Petaling, which is a local flea market. It's 11.30 a.m. and it's plus 30 degrees outside in a shade. It's a hot one. Woo! Let's see how the shopping's gonna go. All the Gucci you might wish for. Gucci, Louis Vuitton, anything you want. You want a mango? No, no ananas. It's right there, 1.50. You want anything else? No, I'm good. The wine is going on us. Nom nom nom. Nom nom nom. So yellow. I'm on us. This cost uh, 1.50 ringgit, which is 50 cents. Exactly 50 cents for this much pineapple. So you can take all of them. in the middle of a busy street. Can get better than that. Fresh sweet fruit, that's the key. Push. Oh. Yum, 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 yum. Yum, 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 yum. Yum, 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 yum. Yum, 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 yum. One more, one more. One more. Traditional Malaysian snacks especially popular during the Lunar New Year is bakwa. It's salty sweet dried pork similar to jerky. We absolutely loved it and if you get a chance to try it, we highly recommend. Six ringgit. Anyway. Okay. I not say the big person. The All the same. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. For the most part, yes. Okay. <laughs> it's been over an hour since we've been wandering around busy streets and buzzing stalls. Disoriented and confused about our whereabouts but fascinated with what local vendors have to offer. The cutest cookies ever! We're visiting Kuala Lumpur during Lunar New Year and these cute bite-sized cookies packaged in plastic jars with red lids are one of the most popular items to give to family and friends during the celebrations. The variety of shapes and flavors is enormous. Amongst the most popular ones are pineapple tarts, love letters, tapioca and peanut cookies. You want to try some cookies? Do you want to buy the rooster cookies? How much? This one 20 this. This one the extra chicken, and this one fresh, fresh meal, this one. This one, the another one, this one the butter cookies, this one the Hello Kitty. Another one, this one the salmon, this one the, the Fresh milk, okay. Yeah. 20. Awesome. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> 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 it's so friendly. <laughs> and so loud. Our hopes of finding Chinatown were not really successful. Little did we know that we were already in Chinatown. Embarrassing to admit guys, but somehow we got it all twisted and got confused. But to get things straight, Yalan Petalin Street Market is located right in the heart of Chinatown. But now we got to Central Market. And if you're looking for shelter from heat and crowd and just overwhelming sun, this is the place for you. It's with air conditioning, it's really lovely, really well organized. 
there are some uh, food options, lots of shopping, same prices as outside, just no plus 30 degrees. It's great. This is a nice environment to work in. Comparing to outside, these guys have it good. By the way, it's two floors. Ooh, mama gonna go to town. <laughs> Most of the souvenirs we wanted we got here at the Central Market, also called Bazaar Seni. Didn't have to fight the crowds or sweat buckets from the heat. Lots of handmade crafts and locally made articles like textiles, clothing, artwork, handmade magnets and keychains. You can even engrave your souvenirs. Overall, very enjoyable shopping experience with great selection and friendly prices. So much stuff. and go back to the hotel for a quick shower and outfit change. Gotta say, it's a little confusing with the street numbers here. Especially to get Uber. W9198. But Uber is crazy cheap here. 15 to 20 minute ride, 2 to 3 bucks. Not like back home. Very fun and exciting evening ahead of us. In our next episode, join us at KLCC Park to marvel at the Fountain Light Show. See you soon and don't forget to subscribe.